I'm the founder of Mama O's Premium Kimchi, and we make uh, kimchi, kimchi products here in Brooklyn, New York. We're located here in the, uh, in the Pfizer building here in Bed-Stuy, Brooklyn, and we're kind of the epicenter of the Brooklyn foodie movement. So the Brooklyn Chamber of Commerce has been great in helping um, me and my fellow Brooklyn businesses uh, really grow our business by uh, having the, the Brooklyn Eat show and also uh, subsidizing some costs for the, the fancy food show. My name is Bob Bland and I'm the CEO and founder of Manufacture New York. I found incredible support from the Chamber of Commerce from the immediate outset and I can definitely say that my business would not be the same without the Brooklyn Chamber of Commerce. When I started creating businesses in 2006, I was 23 years old and there's no way you could get me to join a Chamber of Commerce. So the fact that this Brooklyn Chamber of Commerce has brought so much outreach to the younger generation and made the program so accessible is truly remarkable. What brought me to the Brooklyn Chamber of Commerce honestly was the people. When I moved in here, I quickly learned that it would benefit me as a business to join. So I would know my neighbors, I would know what's going on, and I would get a lot of the business services which I have gotten since I joined. Brooklyn is a very powerful brand and the Chamber is doing an excellent job capturing that power. My name is Joanna Ebenstein and I'm the Creative Director of the Morbid Anatomy Museum. Humanity is the word I want to use. It's just like people banding together. Maybe that's what originally Chambers of Commerce were supposed to be, but it just feels like a bunch of people who are working together to try to make Brooklyn a better place for businesses and nonprofits in a, in a very human way. I had two companies, Dovin Architecture, we're architects providing full service architectural services, and Think Fabricate, where furniture, lighting, and special custom projects. The fun of Brooklyn is finding out about its neighborhoods and who works there and all the different activities going on. I'm Shannon Reinhart and I am the Director of Sales for the Sheraton Brooklyn, New York. Um, Brooklyn as a whole is just becoming its own destination and people want to be here. I, mean, you know, I can't speak for another chamber but this one is like fantastic. Um, uh, they, they, they bring the ballers here so it's a good thing. I recently moved back into the New York area and with um, everything happening in Brooklyn, as fast as it's growing, as big as it's getting, it just there was no question about it. This, these hotels, this hotel in particular, needed to have a great relationship with the Chamber. I'm, I'm Toby Moskowitz. The company is called Heritage Equity Partners, and we're a Brooklyn-based real estate developer. The Brooklyn Chamber, under the leadership of Carlos Sasura, they certainly had a big hand in the commercial and the economic renaissance going on in Brooklyn right now. My name is William Floyd, and I'm the head of external affairs for Google New York. The Chamber of Commerce is helpful to, to our business, Google, in, in a very specific and deep way, which is they are the connective tissue for us and local small and medium-sized businesses. My name is Sophia Sylvester, and what Brooklyn Flavors does is we make skincare products using natural butters and oils that are named after some Brooklyn neighborhoods as well. It's just going to get better and better. You know, they're going to add new programs and just new, new ideas, and, and that's what I really love about the Brooklyn Chamber of Commerce. Brooklyn is where it's at.